Hi, and thanks so much for joining us today for Heart to Heart, experiencing God in a personal way. And we are praying our promises, going through some promises together. And exciting news, if you haven't heard, we have a little promise box that we've put together. We don't have a lot, but these were like handcrafted, hand painted, sanded, and this cool little heart to heart logo here that includes about 120 to 30 of our favorite verses. Mm -hmm. Some are out of the New King James, some out of the Message, some out of the Passion. So you may have heard all this before, but we just want to let you know about it in case you haven't heard. Mm -hmm. We love having you on this program with us, and we invite you to share this program, tell a friend, and um, help spread the word. We're desiring to pray the promises mm -hmm. of God. And how do we do that? We just communicate whatever God puts on our heart or either as an individual or as a couple, mm -hmm. things that he puts or items he puts on our heart about our family or it might be locally, our community, uh, our nation. So we're excited because the promises of God help set up in our heart the way things should be. Mm -hmm. And when we have a promise from the Bible, we have a specific thought where God says, this is how life should be for you. And we stand on that promise, this is how life should be. Mm -hmm. And that helps set up in our heart mm -hmm. the further training into our mind mm -hmm. of this is how I should think about life. Yes. This is how God thinks. And it's a better way. So today we're going to share a promise with you out of, I think it's Psalms. All right. Well, let's pull out And we're going to whip promise. out two versions today. One's message, one's passion. <laughs> One of our favorites. All right, here it is. It is Psalm 73, 24. And in the message, it says this, you wisely and tenderly lead me, and then you bless me. In the Passion, it says this, you lead me with your secret wisdom, and following you brings me into your brightness and glory. Mm -hmm. That's awesome. So when we look at a scripture like this, I like to study it, look at it, and just, you know, kind of ask the Lord, like, what are you seeing in here? And I think what's jumping out to me in here is that he leads me, and he says he leads me wisely and tenderly. Mm -hmm. And that really gives insight into the character of God, the, the father that he is. Um, is a tender father. Mm -hmm. It's a wise and tender father and then you bless me. So the other thing that I'm seeing as I read this is um, the first step is that I seek him and allow him really to wisely and tenderly lead me. Mm -hmm. And that leads into blessing. Yes, it Isn't does. Great? It's really great. One of the things I love about this idea is God leads, leads wisely. Mm -hmm which means he takes all the information that's necessary for life and godliness, as the Bible says, mm -hmm. and he puts the pieces together. A lot of times in life, it kind of feels like we're in a puzzle and we get one piece, but we're not quite sure how that piece fits to another piece. And what God does is he helps bring the pieces together. And when he brings them together to form a picture, that's part of his wisdom mm -hmm. because he's forming all the pieces necessary to apply the truth that he's given us. And I love the way it says tenderly because for me, I need a lot of patience. Sometimes I'm a little bit like thick up here and I'm like, okay, God, I really want to know what you're saying, but I just need, can you just give me a little bit more information here? Mm -hmm. And um, he doesn't get upset about that. He doesn't he doesn't feel like, oh my gosh, I can't believe I'm explaining mm -hmm. this again. He's just so kind mm -hmm. to keep bringing the, all the pieces together so we get a clear picture and it's through a process. It's not just what he says, but it's the way he says it. Right. He says it in love. Right. And then out of that experience is blessing. And this is what we're excited about sharing today mm -hmm. is that this verse is telling you God's going to put all the pieces together in your life mm -hmm. where maybe you don't understand them all, but he's going to bring them all together. Mm -hmm. He's going to do it in a tender way and he's going to bless you. Yeah. And the way like when I read a verse like this, the way that I apply it is I just see some areas in my life right now that I really need his leading. 
And、mm-hmm. if you look at the passion, it says, "You lead me with your secret wisdom." I need some of that secret wisdom.、Mm-hmm. So I think about some areas that I really want His wisdom, and I need His guidance. And what's beautiful about it is I can also pray and agree with Him that because I'm seeking Him, when I respond to Him, I know that blessing is. Following, or、mm-hmm. in this case, with the passion, it says, "You lead me into your brightness and glory." And so, I think about the areas I need this help, but I also, with assurance, knowing as I submit these questions to you, Father, I know that you are leading me into blessing and your brightness and glory. So it gives an expectation. It just makes me feel really good about like. Wow, I don't know what to do here. So maybe even writing down areas or things that come to mind that you don't even maybe realize, but you really needed some guidance. Reading a scripture like this just kind of brings that to the top, and it gives me that confidence that as I'm taking the step, I'm taking the word, I'm bringing things before Him that I know blessing is going to follow.、Mm-hmm. So it's sort of an expectation. That、mm-hmm. I know is going to happen as a result of this.、Mm-hmm. And one of the things I love about how you approach life with our children is, as a parent, you th- begin thinking about the pieces that are moving,、mm-hmm. and you want your child. And when I say child, it doesn't matter how old they are. Right. It could be two years old, up to however old. Right. But you're thinking of your child, and you're thinking of the pieces that are moving in their life, and、mm-hmm. you're just praying into that.、Mm-hmm. And it's great to know that you're not praying out of fear, but you're praying alignment、mm-hmm. that God would bring the alignment of the pieces in place,、mm-hmm. so that your children would experience the kind of life that God has for them.、Mm-hmm. And that's part of the beauty of praying these promises.、Mm-hmm. It's it's way beyond us as individuals. It is. It's exciting to pray into the future of our children. It is for God's blessing. It is, and even just like thank you, Lord, that you are wisely and tenderly leading our children,、mm-hmm. and then you are blessing them.、Mm-hmm. So we can declare things for our children and grandchildren, employees. We do that, like、mm-hmm. people that work for us, our family members, our communities, our country. Leaders,、mm-hmm. right? And we can apply these promises to their life because when they're in Jesus, it's yes and amen. That's right. And so it's just so powerful. And all that just coming from this one verse.、Mm-hmm. Yeah, it's really fun. Like we want to encourage you to take some time, take a verse, and I'm not quite sure how to describe it. Except for maybe think about letting it breathe,、mm-hmm. Let, letting because this is this even though they're、mm-hmm. words, it, they are alive,、mm-hmm. they're spiritual, and it's like the Holy Spirit breathes on it. And as you allow、mm-hmm. it to breathe, and you think about it, you contemplate. This verse can take on so many different like、right. expressions, where it really becomes a beautiful part of not only your own experience, but the experience you have as a couple as.、Um, A family, in so many settings,、Absolutely. it's really wonderful. It's awesome.、Mm-hmm. All right, should we pray for everybody? Yes, love to. All right, Father, I thank you so much for your word, and I just、um, impress upon everybody watching how how open you are, how willing, and how much you want to be a father in this area, and that as we seek you, that we. Attain your wisdom and your secrets, Lord, and we thank you that you are blessing us as a result of following your lead. So, Lord, whether it's family, whether it's work, whether it's business, whatever it might be, whether it's a community, country, any area of our life, Lord, we just place it before you. We ask for your wisdom and your leading, and in confidence, we receive it. And we thank you that we are blessed.、Mm-hmm. We praise you and we give you all the glory in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. Well, thank you so much for joining Dave and I today、uh, for praying the promises as part of Heart to Heart, and we will see you next time.